I'm Cooper. I'm number nine. I play quarterback, and I'm going to be a senior. I'm Hunter Sofka. I'm an offensive lineman, and I'm a defensive end. All I'm right. going to be a senior this year. My name is Trayvon Jeffrey. Um, I'm going to be a junior, and I play running back and outside linebacker. I'm JT Swank. I'm going to be a senior, offensive guard, and defensive tackle. Latrell Payton, uh, class of 2020, and I play running back in quarter. Caden Whaley, number three, sophomore, wide receiver. I'm Cody Moore. Uh, I'm a court best, that's wide receiver. I play free safety on defense. Well, my name's David Moore. Uh, I'm a junior this year. My positions are linebacker and wide receiver. And my goal this preseason is to get better so we can, so I can do my 111th to win this year. Devontae Best, play, I'm number 23. I play wide receiver and free safety. And one of the main goals for me this year is to get more playing time. And one of the main goals for the team this year is not to go three and seven. Well, this year we're going to work as a team. We haven't really had the leadership in the past other than the team that went to the playoffs. But we just need to work as a team and get back on the ball. I feel like we've really come together since last season, since, you know, we had a kind of a rough season last year. And we've all come together a lot more as a team. To get better every day. To be the best that we can be, to get make plays this year, and for my teammates to succeed. Uh, just get better every day, just come out and work. Um, better than we were yesterday. Just change the culture around here. Hey, hey, hey. All on us. What that weight, what that pressure, homie. All on us. Who put the city on this? All on us. And if they hate and want it, all on us. All on us. All on us. What that weight, what that pressure, homie. All on us. Who put the city on this? All on us. Yeah. And if they hate and want it, all on us. All on us. It's Memorial Day weekend at Hambridge, Ohio. And as a way to honor the military, the team decides to do a Murph challenge. That's what the Murph is, it's a mile run. Once you get done with your first mile, you're gonna do 100 pull-ups. After you get done with your 100 pull-ups, you're gonna do your 200 push-ups. After that, you're gonna do 300 air squats. And then you're gonna finish up with another mile. Team Thickness won. My team came out on top. It was a good team bonding experience where you learned how to like, co cooperate with each other and do things. It was just a good bonding. Help us know each other better. We fit in, know our rules.
Hey, hey, good job today. Okay. Listen, I know it was tough, but the whole thing was about teamwork. That's all we wanted you guys to do. Okay? Thanks, Luke. So good job. Give yourself a round of applause. Three, one, two, three, catch! Drink a lot of water. Make sure to cut the Stance. Start. Those feet looking heavy, boy. In the blue. For the defensive bats this year, they have a new role model for them. Former NFL player, Joe Harder. Full ride to the University of Akron uh, for football. Played corner for my first two years. Got all conference at safety my junior year and then played receiver my senior year. Then got picked up by the St. Louis Rams out of college as an undrafted free agent. Then played arena ball for uh, about three months. Played up in Canada. After that, for three years, won a great cup championship up there. Then I got picked up by the Minnesota Vikings. And uh, when, after they released me, I went back up to Canada to finish out the year. And that concluded my career. Jalil now stays in Ambridge as a real estate agent and as a mentor to many high school athletes in the area. He's a lot of help. He helps us out a lot and he makes us such better players. Yeah! It makes me step up my game and he's on a whole other level and it's, it's a lot more work that needs to be done. It's pretty cool. He knows what he's doing so helps us out a lot. Good. It's a great experience, you know, he's really experienced with the game, he knows what he's talking about, and it's just awesome to, you know, hear what he has to say and what he has to teach us. When I was training to go to Minnesota, I didn't know that they were T-stepping, and I was training my, what he was doing, my bicycle, coming out without putting all my cleats in the ground. With that being said, it sounds like T-step is the most used. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's going to make our corners like faster, bigger, and stronger, come out so we get these interceptions and stuff for our, for our corners so they can be ready. Go. Balance. Go. Good. Yes. Good job, guy. Good. The T-step is like you're pushing off of a wall. And you're out of there. Can you imagine? Getting ready to run like this with your foot on the wall? It was fun. He, he worked your hard. I had stolen hands. I couldn't catch. He worked on my catching. And, you know, helped a lot. I'm really excited for these guys. Um, the, the great championship teams, I noticed, they, they're really close-knit. They're really tight-knit group. And they depend on one another. And from, from my professional career, only winning one championship, that championship team taught me, you know, how a team it's supposed to operate together and we had each other's backs and we held each other accountable and the only way you can really hold someone else accountable is if you're holding yourself accountable first and that's what we're going to need we're going to need our seniors to step up and lead the way a uh, new culture around here and i'm really excited good day of work y'all definitely got better today it says if people saw what it took to achieve my mastery they wouldn't think it was so exciting at all. They wouldn't think it was extraordinary at all. So we just got to keep coming, keep working on your own. You guys know the drills to do for your feet. Get your feet together. This is what this time is for. Get your feet, get your body together. And by the time season comes and scheme comes, we'll be, we'll be in really good shape. All right? Yes, all right, bring it up. Let's get a cats on three. One, two, three, cats! to hit their agility up, both football and basketball teams had NST come in to help train them. We've had like four sessions so far and those four sessions I can tell as a, as a player and as a leader that everyone's doing well, it's improving all our skills and it's going to put us on top this year. From what we heard, they're the best, and they help us get our agility, get our strength up, 
So by the time it's game time, we'll be all ready, all built and stuff. It's just an awesome program. Getting us a lot better with our lifting and our footwork. Come on, break out, break out, break out, stay low. Good. Five, three. Boom, boom. Look like a butterfly, sting like baby. Three, one, five. This is getting us better. I increased my speed and I also increased my vertical jump, so it's going good. In the mini combine, the one person that impressed many was the trout paint. 26. <laughs> you go into the NBA, someone gets a bump out on you. For many, it's a really fun experience for them. It's a lot of fun. Uh, Coach Sadler's pretty cool and it's a lot of fun. So now, the team is almost ready. Oh, I can't wait. Lots of fun. It's lots of fun. I love football season. That's, that's a good time coming up. I'm ready. Let's get going. On the next episode of Rare Anatomy. I think we're all ready to get on the field and get going against other competition and just going against each other. Man, I'm so excited. Like, where can I explain how excited I am? It's honestly an honor, but it's also nerve wracking. Who put the city on its And if they hate him, they all on us. All on us. I'm a long way to sit. Hey, look at my leg. I got a flex boy. Oh, wow. 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 This is the only guy's ever been